came through my neighborhood. I was so excited, I ran to go get my piggy bank. I had just enough money to buy my favorite ice cream. I ran outside and my friends were getting ice cream treats too. But just as I took my first bite, no! Sam bumped into me and made me drop my ice cream and splat. It was totally ruined. I am so mad at Sam. 
and sad and really, really mad. Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hello, Peyton. Who? Who? Feeling upset today, are you? Oh, hi, Ollie. Sam made me drop my ice cream. I see you're mad. It's true. But we can love even when we're angry, too. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Follow me through, follow me through who? Ollie's got a Bible story for me and you. Oh, hello, friends. I'm Aisha, and welcome to my cupcake food truck. Check out today's special. Ta-da! <laughs> These are my totally tree top treats. <laughs> See the little trees on top? Raise your hand if you've ever climbed a tree. <gasps> well, today I've got a story about a man who climbed a tree to see something really special. Do you want to hear it? If you're ready for the story, on the count of three, yell, tell me a story. One, two, three, tell me a story. This true story from the Bible begins with a man named Zacchaeus. That's a fun name to say. Can you say that with me? Zacchaeus. Good job! Zacchaeus was a tax collector. His job was to collect money from everyone in town. Let's count with Zacchaeus. Each person owes one coin. Ready? One, two, three! <laughs> Great! Wait, what is Zacchaeus doing? He's going back for more money? That's not right, those people already paid. But that's what Zacchaeus did. He took more money than he was supposed to and he kept it for himself. It was wrong and it made everyone mad at Zacchaeus. Nobody wanted to be his friend. But one day, something wonderful happened. Jesus came to town. <laughs> everyone, including Zacchaeus, was so excited to see him. Zacchaeus wanted to see Jesus because he knew Jesus was special. He was sure Jesus wouldn't want to be his friend, but Zacchaeus at least wanted to see Jesus. Oh no! Zacchaeus is too short to see over all the people. He can't see Jesus. If only there was something Zacchaeus could climb to see over all the people. Oh, a tree? Yes! Zacchaeus could climb the tree. Let's cheer him on. Climb, 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 climb. Now he could see Jesus and Jesus could see him. Jesus said, Zacchaeus, come down right away. I want to go to your house today. All the people thought, why would Jesus want to go with him? He's made so many bad choices. But do you think there is anything we can do to make Jesus stop loving us? No, even if we make a bad choice, does Jesus still love us? Yes, <laughs> Jesus loves us no matter what. And Jesus loves Zacchaeus too. Zacchaeus was happy to have Jesus come to his house for dinner. Jesus was so kind and loving to Zacchaeus that it made Zacchaeus want to be kind and loving to other people. In fact, Zacchaeus was so happy that Jesus loved him and was his friend that he gave back all the money he took from the people. Jesus loved Zacchaeus. Jesus loves everyone. <laughs> did you like the story? If you did, give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. Hi, Ollie, tell me, who does Jesus love? Jesus loves everyone. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me. Who does Jesus love? Jesus loves everyone. That's the truth, friends. See you next time. Bye. So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus loves Zacchaeus when he did something wrong. And Jesus loves us all the time, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, Zacchaeus took money that wasn't his. Zacchaeus did wrong things, but Jesus loved him anyway. And Jesus loves us too, even when we do something wrong. I think I got the story. Did you get it?
if you did, say got it. Get it? Got it. Good. I'm still sad about my ice cream, but I can forgive Sam. We all make mistakes, and Jesus loves everyone. I'm going to drive my ice cream truck to tell Sam that Jesus loves him. See you next time. Bye. Be kind and loving to each other. Ephesians 4.32 Be kind and loving to each other. Ephesians 4.32